Guys, Seb the Dev here, back with another networking video of our game. So the first thing we are going to do is going to jump straight into it. Today we are making the bullet, which comes from the player when it is clicked. It will send the bullet to the other player, and you can see it on the screen. In the next episode, we will be making it look better and making it destroy the player when it is hit. So first of all, we need to create a sprite. Let's call this SPR Bullet. It needs to be of the dimensions of 8 by 16. You can do whatever you want. This is just my preference for now. We will make the origin in middle center and edit image. We will just fill it white. So now we've done that, we just need to head in and create an object called OBJ bullet. So this is just a pretty simple object with just one line of code. So first we need to, of course, make set it to that sprite. And in a step event, this will just to make to move the bullet. And we just need to go motion set direction and then the speed of 10. So now we've done that, we can get into the lobby for the most the, the meat of the tutorial. So now we just need to head into the step event. So what we're going to do is that right at the bottom, we are going to just to add the bottom. Okay, if mouse check button pressed, MB left. If connected and player socket does not equal 999, so that's just saying, oh, sorry, it, this should be or. So this is just saying it so it will work for either if it is connected for the client or if the player socket does not equal 999, which is what it starts as, then it will run this code. So bullet equals instance create layer. Local player dot x, of course, the variable we did make earlier. Local player dot y instances, oh, gonna be capital specific for the layer and object bullet. So now we've done that, we can set the direction of the bullet to be point direction. So this 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 function. So it sets the direction from a base x and y to the x and to a so say you have one x and y here. So this is the coordinate here where my mouse is, and the other coordinate is here. The direction will be going this way. So that's that's just how it works. So if point to play, point direction local player dot x local player dot y mouse x that variable and mouse underscore y. So now we've got to write it to the buffer so it will send it to the server or the client. Buffer seek buffer buffer seek start zero just like normal just to get to the beginning of the buffer. Buffer write buffer buffer u8 three buffer right buffer buffer u16 and then add the bullet dot direction so that's the direction that we are adding so now to send it we can copy this code we have here and just paste it right there that should be all right Just format it, make it look nice. Alright, so now we've done that, that's all we need to do for this step event. So the next thing we need to do is head into our networking and we need to add the networking in the both the client and the host. So above case two in the client in the join one, we will say case three bullet equals instance create layer 
global play dot x global play dot y instances object bullet so we're creating the instance then bullet dot direction so we're creating um, of course that's just creating the bullet at the x and y coordinates of the um, global player so bullet di bot direction equals buffer read buffer buffer u16 because that's what we wrote it to so it has to be the same and now break so that's pretty simple so next of course we just got to go into the server part it is the exact same thing so break we can just copy and paste this in and we finished that so it should be finished so I'll just export this package as zip and it will export and we should have the game running after okay I just realized I forgot in here just to chain to add a couple of lines of code that I forgot to add so in here we've got to go buffer equals async load buffer and in here we just got to change this to rep buffer okay so now I've done that we can export again and now in here we'll open the online game dot host set the dev bit of free advertising open another one and as you can see here we have the bullets coming out of both ones go here So that works so thank you for watching please like if you enjoyed subscribe and make sure to comment to give some feedback and i will see you guys next time